You want to get world edit in Minecraft 1.21.10? Let's do it. First things first, go to the second link down below, and that will take you here. This is our in-depth guide on getting world edit that most importantly, when you click download here, will take you to their official download page. This and everything we talk about in this video is linked down below. Once you're here, go ahead and click on files, and then you want to find that 1.21.10 version. Right here it is. Go ahead and hover over it, click the three dots, and click download, and the download will begin after a few seconds. While this is downloading, have a quick message from our hosting provider, Simple Game Hosting. Go to the first link in the description down below to start your very own 24-hour DDoS-protected Minecraft server for you and your friends. You can easily add mods, plugins, and mod packs to your server and truly customize your server any way that you want. There's even expert live chat support there to help you out, so check out Simple Game Hosting at the first link in the description down below. The breakdown.xyz says SGH and start your Minecraft server the simple way. We can go ahead and save world it there and now we need to download fabric this is what actually allows world edit to work in minecraft it's of course linked down below and we can click download fabric here to open up the official download page on this page click on download universal jar and the download will begin but you probably will need to keep or save the file finally we can go ahead and minimize our browser and we will find in our downloads folder fabric and world edit we want to start off with the fabric installer to do that, right click on it, click on open with, and click Java. But what if you don't have Java listed here? Well, in that case, you need to get Java 21. This, of course, is linked down below. Complete guide, but it's super easy. Just click download here, and then go to Windows and download this x64 installer. From there, this is going to install just like any other program on your computer. At which point, you may need to run the jar fix as well, but usually just installing Java does it, and you'll be able to right click on fabric, click on open with, and click Java. Finally, we'll open up the Fabric Installer, leave everything the same, assuming the latest version is still 1.21.10. If not, select it here and click Install. The only reason this wouldn't work is if Minecraft and the Minecraft Launcher are open, make sure both of those are closed. Click OK, close out of Fabric, and you can actually delete the Fabric Installer. Now let's install World Edit. To do that, you want to go ahead and open up the Minecraft Launcher, and then in the Minecraft Launcher, we're going to have an Installations tab at the top. Make sure Modded is checked, and you'll see Fabric. Hover over it and click the folder icon. That will take you to your Minecraft folder, where you should have a Mods folder. If you don't have one of these, just make one. Create your own. Open up your Mods folder and drag and drop World Edit in it. It's that easy to get World Edit installed in Minecraft 1.21.10. And now all we need to do is play Minecraft using Fabric. In game, we can do slash slash wand to get our World Edit wand, and then you can kind of use it however you want. For example, if I wanted this out here to be like a different block texture, for example, we wanted to make all of this gravel, we could do slash slash replace and we want to replace grass blocks with gravel and boom it is all replaced but actually I don't like to look at that so I could do undo now world edit is super complex there's a lot more you can do with this the basics is you can right click and left click to make selections and that'll now affect everything in between these two blocks and it does go horizontal and vertical as well so any direction you can kind of go with that and if we wanted to fill this area up we could just kind of replace the air so we could do slash slash replace and then air with dirt for example and um, now all the air is dirt which uh, we obviously we don't want that so there you have it that's how you can kind of get world edit going there's a lot more complex stuff to world edit but this video is really just how to install it so we will see you in the next video and i'm out peace